Ayuboan, Vanakam. Good morning from the second largest city here in Sri Lanka, Kandy. And right beside me here, this is one of the premier hotels here, which has been a long time here in Kandy. That's the Queen's Hotel. And opposite, we've got the Temple of the Sacred Toot here in Kandy, one of the most important and significant cultural centers here in Kandy. And it's also a World UNESCO heritage site. Now, this morning we have already explored the temple and walked around the city. So now I'm looking for an authentic Sri Lankan breakfast. Now I have been told that if I walk straight down, there's a restaurant that I can check out so I can get to experience what it's really like to have a very good authentic Sri Lankan breakfast. So walk with me as we go and find this. So the time now it's around eight in the morning and um, the weather, in terms of the, the temperature, it's around 20 degrees. So it definitely does get really warm and here in Kandy. But at the same time, the weather is also cool in the evening time, which is a little different from Colombo. So in Kandy, you get to experience different types of weather. So that's really nice when you travel to a place. You get to experience the best of both worlds, they say. So the place I'll be going to is right over there. It's called Balaji Dosa. Now, it is a kind of a vegetarian place. And I have been told they serve some really good Sri Lankan dishes. So, I'm going to walk in there and let's see if we can experience something really authentic this morning. So, this is it inside. Aibawa. Uh, order. Yeah, order, yeah. Order. So this is inside the restaurant and uh, we will go and see what they're serving. Very busy in here this morning. A lot of people. So you will see a lot of people coming here in the morning from what I've been told. A lot of people are, have their breakfast here and then they'll be heading on to work and different things like that. So it's something that you usually see when you travel to Sri Lanka. Ivan. Ivan. Good morning. Good morning. morning yeah. Now how are you, sir? I'm okay. How are yeah. you? Oh, fine. Right. Now I'm I, I, from England. Oh, good. Yeah. So yesterday I came here. Do you remember me? I ordered food yesterday. But so, I yeah. 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 What but, but what I want to find out is I want to taste a real authentic Sri Lankan breakfast. Uh, so which one do you recommend I buy? I want real Sri Lankan breakfast. Okay. Uh, do you like spicy or? Um, Little spicy, not too spicy. spicy. Then you take masala dosa. Which one is that? Here, the masala dosa. Okay, yeah. so that so that one is, is a Sri Lankan uh, yes, breakfast. Yes, yes. Okay, and anything else with it? Uh, and if you start at the vada. Okay, uh, which one here? Yeah. Here. Uh, okay. Which one you recommend? Because I don't really yes. know. I will recommend the masala dosa. Yeah. And one uh, vada. Okay, yes. Sir. What do you like to drink? Uh, uh, tea or coffee? I, I like tea. You have authentic Sri Lankan tea? Yes, yes. Okay, I'll take that. Okay. Yep. So, right, so we're going to have the dosa. So it's the masala dosa. Yes. And yes. what's the other one? Uh, the wada. The wada. Yes. Yeah, so we're having the masala dosa and the wada. Real Sri Lankan breakfast here. And I'll have some Ceylon tea. So let's see how that goes. 820 sir. Eight. So yeah, the cost of the, the breakfast, 820 Sri Lankan rupees. All right. So let's pay him. Can we like sit here or upstairs? Um, downstairs is fine. Yeah. All right. So 820. So this is a 
1,000 Sri Lankan rupees. That's what it's looked like. All right, there you go, sir. Thank you. My receipt. So the name of the restaurant is, is it Balaji Dosa? Yeah, that's right. All right, good. Balaji Dosa. Thank, Thank you very much, sir. It's Have good. a nice day. Thank you. All right, so they do provide your number and someone will come over and serve you. So let's see where I can eat this morning. Uh, yeah. I think I'm going to eat right here. So guys, I've ordered my food. Everything came up to 820 and I got the masala dosa and the wada with also tea as well. So when it comes, we'll taste that, really sample the food and see what it's like to have an authentic Sri Lankan breakfast. So this is the breakfast. Okay. All right, so this is the dosa. 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 And this, this one? Nal ready. All right. Ulundu ready. This ulundu ready, this ghee masala dosa. Ghee? Ma masala dosa, right? Ghee right. masala dosa. All right, and this, this is the word there. Oh. Do you know how this one is made? Oh, this put this is. So I've got, I put this in there, yeah? All right. So this is my breakfast, guys. This is what it looks like. So we got the... Let me put this together for you, all right. Okay, all right, so we got the masala dosa here, and we seem to have some spices here with it, chili, um, potato stuff, all right, and we've got the roda, all right, so let's dig in, and let me see what it, this really tastes like, all right, so, hmm. I don't know how I'm going to eat this, I'm trying it for the first time, all right, all right, let's, let's go. Right. Yeah, this is, I don't even know what I'm really doing guys, but this really freestyling it here to be honest. Uh, let's see. Usually eat with your hands here in Sri Lanka. Um, well, certain foods in Sri Lanka, some people eat with their hands. Not everyone does that, but some people do. So I'm doing it the traditional way, I guess, with my hands. This tastes, the dosa, the dosa tastes like a cheesy type of flatbread. Cheesy type of flatbread. But when you mix it with the spices here, like these ones, so I'm gonna kinda do something like this, maybe this, all together with a bit of that. So let's see, it looks like this. So some of it is a bit spicy and um, you have a bit of a cheesy flavor. And this one here tastes like, um, slightly like hummus. I don't know if you know that from what they use with the falafel. This is a bit spicy as well. Let me try it with this paste also. So let me rip it here. Rip it like that, wow. This is the dosa. Now I have seen a lot of people eat this here in Sri Lanka. Okay. All right, so I take I took it here with the cheese, well, kind of a orange type of paste. Mmm. Wow. Yeah, this one, wow. Mm. I'm not sure what this one is, but it went in my mouth, it had a bit of a sweet taste and then after it became spicy. Wow. This is very, very interesting. The, the food here, the flavors literally changes sometimes after being in your mouth for, for, for a certain period of time. But it's leaving a bit of a spicy aftertaste. So this is it guys. This is what I've got, I got here. So this is the dosa. The various spices as well. Some taste like hummus, a yogurt flavor. Very spicy. Okay, we move on to the warda here. Kind of reminds me of a bit of a donut. Small donut a bit. Let's see what's going on. So I kind of 
Wow, I can taste the spice in my mouth. So I've kind of um, broke a piece off and I'm gonna put it in this sauce. All right, something like that. So this is, this is what it's like, guys. This tastes like, honestly, it tastes like a bit of a salted bake of it. And they got a, a bit of a bit, slight, sl very, very light spice taste. But this one is much more bland than like the dosa and stuff. And the pace, really, really have a cool pace. You know, it's, it's almost like a bit of a kind of a hummus as well, hummus type um, pace. And it really isn't spicy at all. This one really kind of, um, I guess you'll have this one first and then you eat this after because this one it really kind of it's a very cool taste it isn't spicy so it, it almost like if the food's very spicy on this side this one kind of cools it down you know so this balances the spiciness of this one so that's very interesting guys so I guess this is my experience of having a Sri Lankan breakfast and now I'll wait for my cup of tea So my tea has arrived, it's two tea, thank you so much. So guys bring my tea, so this is the tea. Now within the, the dosa guys, there's, there seem to be a bit of um, potato and stuff in it. It almost reminds me a bit of a roti what you get in the, in the Caribbean shops in London and stuff like that. So this is it here, I believe it's like potato and all of that. So let me taste that. A really type of a cheesy taste with the dosa with the potato inside it it's almost like there's a bit of a cheesy flavor so I guess like I was doing previously you gotta take a bit of this and mix it with all of these pastes to make it really taste nice all right this is my tea this is what my tea look like so I think the tea is like a bit of a Ceylon tea um, with milk. Now Sri Lanka is known to produce some of the best teas in the world. If you ever heard of Lipton tea, he had a farm here in the Ella area here in Sri Lanka. So let's taste this tea. Wow, one thing I would say, tea in Sri Lanka is extremely sweet for my taste. This is a very sweet tea. still tastes almost like it's almost like black tea um, with the milk and sugar I don't taste the cinnamon or any cinnamon flavor or anything like that so this is just your standard type of black tea with milk and sugar but you can tell it's very fresh and organic from the tea that is grown here in Sri Lanka ah. all right guys thanks for watching